Council Member Eagerly. Thanks, Chris, Thank very you. much. Moving on to the consent agenda. Make a motion to approve. I, uh, oh, go ahead, Councilman uh, Gordon. Uh, uh, number three, can we repair those leaks in the sprinkler system, or that's not really how it's done? You just kind of replace it? Ms. Woods? So this is the overhead uh, sprinkler system that we have over there. It's mm -hmm. approximately 50 years old. We did have it inspected two years ago, I believe. It was slated to get done last year, but because of getting quotes and getting everything lined up and making sure we had a, a sufficient amount of time with no renters in there, we had to push it back a year. But we have made repairs in the, pa in the past to the rubber gaskets that dry out and then cause the leaking. Because it's a dry pressurized system, we have to make sure that the integrity keeps there because if we drop pressure, it floods the system and floods the facility, which we have had that happen back in the day. Um, but we do feel like we've made the repairs that we can make and at this time we have to replace it. 50 years is long enough, yeah. Okay, that's all I have. I have a motion from Councilman Lundin to approve. Do I have a second? Second. Second by Councilman Burgley. All in favor say aye. 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 Jack Dalton, aye. Opposed, same sign. Motion to adjourn. No. Nope. Nope. Motion carries 5-0. Oh, we can't adjourn? No. Other communications, we have to review conflict of interest policy. Uh, Mayor and Council, before you, you do have the annual conflict of um, interest policy, if you may fill that out, and then the, uh, Ms. Jaden will collect that at the end of the meeting. And then we have a closed meeting. Done, done, and done. Yes, we and do. Let's move on to the closed session for discussion uh, to